Hi there, it's Miriam with Engadget. I'm here at CompuSex 2012 at the TI booth with uh, Bill Crean. Hi Bill, how are you doing? I'm doing great, it's really an exciting week. Yes, so you're going to show us something really, pretty exciting. I'm just going to pull back right now and show everyone. It is Windows RT running on TI OMAP, correct? Absolutely right. This is our development platform for Windows RT running on the OMAP 4470 platform. Right, so this is a development system and what uh, do you want to show us? Well, it's, it's an exciting time as we're really seeing the performance of the graphics driver especially. I can show you swiping fast. Wow, that's very, very good. Not so good with my left hand, <laughs> but I can show you the bringing up the apps and then we have CNN.com here and I can show you the scrolling. Now that is the fast and fluid scrolling that we come to expect in a PC. Indeed. And we're seeing that running on OMAP 4470, there's no compromise. Right. So that's just dual core right now. It's great. It's a dual core uh, our, uh, Cortex A9 system with a STX544 graphics processor and dual channel memory, which is right. important because and you need the high memory bandwidth in order to leverage all the other cores in the system. That is a unique feature to TI, correct? It is a special advantage of the TI OMAP 4 processor. Yes. Obviously, you, some partners have announced some products with your uh, with your chipset. Can you tell us a little more about that? That's what's really great this week as well. So Toshiba, a lead OEM partner of ours, has announced they'll they'll launch two products based on OMAP 4470. One thin tablet and one thin and light clamshell. They're both super sexy products, and they'll launch when Windows RT launches. Are we looking at uh, potentially a quad core in the future? We won't comment about uh, anything in the, too far in the future, but right now, a dual core is really the place to be as far as applications. And uh, we have what we call the smart multi core architecture. So we have the right balance of uh, processors inside the chip to be maximize performance within a thermal envelope. Right, you want really also. in a mobile device. Yeah, absolutely. Battery life is critical. So you're f op obviously optimizing for that right now. Very optimizing much. for that. And what's great, you saw the great performance, yep. but also what we bring is the low power and the long battery life enabling the connected standby state. So great. bringing those two together is what's really going to change the industry. Super. Thank you so much, Bill. Thank you. Cheers.